Hello everyone, it is Susan here. Welcome to my channel today. Uh, we're going to work on our second prayer tag. I'm probably going to do one more after this, um, but we will see. Uh, maybe two, I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. So I have everything pulled out. I'm going to work in... Um, okay, so well, this was the last prayer tag right here. And so I want to make sure I go over, you know, a few pages because I don't want them next to one another. So I figured I would work on this piece of pattern paper from Busy Sidewalks Collection. And because um, I thought it would look pretty. So let me see. Can I zoom in just a tad? Just a tad. Okay. Alrighty, so um, all of this paper is actually from the same collection. Uh, I'm not sure if that is, it could be, but this little piece down here is. Um, but anyway, so this is a pre, <laughs> I don't know why I'm saying that, but anyway, um, this is a pre-made belly band that I had done probably a couple months ago, knowing that, you know, I would be adding it into my December daily. This is actually a pre-made tag that I had made in another Tag Tuesday, which I'm going to use today as my prayer tag. So I think the first thing I'll do is let's just go ahead and... Um, I'm trying to think, do I want to use this or my tape runner? I think I'll just use my tape runner. Uh, if I can find it, I will. Here we go. So this is the Tombow tape runner, permanent. All right, so let's get this on here. Okay, good, 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 good. So I just, you know, when you do something like this with a belly band, you just want to make sure that your page, um, like whatever you have that's going to stick out, um, is not on the uh, spine side. You want it on the open side. Just something to think about. Okay, so that's what it's going to look like what it's when it's in there. Um, now I do know that I want to add, whoops, got all kinds of stuff here, the word joy. And I wanna add this word joy because I wanted to do um, a video about joy as well. Um, and so I had this puffy sticker and I'm gonna put it on the tag. Um, obviously under the belly band, uh, but I kind of, I think I want it under this belly band so that you really can't see it. Um, all right, so I'm just gonna kind of eyeball it here. And let's see, let's see, I'm thinking right about there-ish. Uh, I think that was about right. I mean, if it sticks out a little bit, I am a-okay with that. Let me get the little dot for the I, or for the J, sorry. Joy, okay, good, 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 good. So that's it for the front side, now the back side. So I do have some staples in here, um, and I do have other little pieces here. So I have some scripture that I definitely want to add because, well, to me, that's where joy comes from. Um, is our relationship with Jesus Christ. And I thought this was cute, joy to the world. So like I basically looked through my, you know, my stash to see what there was that, that I could use that said joy. So if I had that there and see, I might not be able to, like, I didn't expect to find this much to add on here, 
So I might not be able to use like even this, which is fine. Uh, Cause I really did want to get these other verses on here and they can be every which way. They don't have to be um, perfect on here by any means. I just want them on there. Um, let me go ahead and let's get this down and I'm going to read it to you. Um, it's quite a long, verse or um, area of scripture but i i want to read it to you so but let's get it down first so for this i'm going to use some of my glue stick and we'll get this down now it is going to have those staples under it, and I'm going to be A-OK -okay with that. All right, that's that piece. Let me make sure I have, yes. Make sure I'm gluing the right side. OK, whoopsie daisy. All right, I'm going to move that to the side. This was on two different pages. That's why it's in two, <laughs> two different um, pieces here. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and read this to you. So the reason I wanted to focus on joy on one of my pages um, was because that's my all-time favorite word, um, I don't really do, you know, the one little word every year. I used to, but I haven't done that in a while. Um, there's just a couple things that I tend to focus on pretty much all the time. So, and one of them is joy. That's my all time favorite word. And, you know, um, we get our joy from the Lord, right? So joy is different than happiness. Happiness comes because of a situation, something that happened that makes us happy, right? But joy, joy lives within us. And so even as we're going through our tough times, for me, my joy helps to get me through because it's just like a foundation within within me, part of who I am, that, that I have to remember and um, and feel and focus on the joy that I have within me. So I'm going to read this to you. Um, this is from the book of Luke in the Bible, and it is from chapter 2, and it's verses 1 through 14. So it's, it's long, but I wanted to read it, so I'm going to read it to all of you if you don't you know, if you want to speed up, go ahead and speed up. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to kind of lift it up so I can see it. And I'm going to close this curtain because, well, the sun is popping in. Okay, here we go. So Luke chapter 2. In those days, a decree went out from Caesar Augustus that all the world should be enrolled. This was the first enrollment when uh, Quinarius was governor of Syria, and all went to be enrolled, each to his own city. And Joseph also went up from Galilee, from the city of Nazareth, to Judea, to the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, because he was of the house and lineage of David, to be enrolled with Mary, his betrothed, who was with child. And while they were there, the time came for her to be delivered. And she gave birth to her firstborn son and wrapped him in swaddling clothes and wrapped, um, sorry, in swaddling clothes and laid him in a manger because there was no place for them in the inn. And in that region, there were shepherds out in the field, keeping watch over their flock by night. And an angel of the Lord appeared to them and the glory of the Lord shone around them and they were filled with fear. And the angel said to them, Be not afraid, for behold, I bring you good news of great joy, which will come to all the people. For to you is born this day in the city of David a Savior, who is Christ the Lord. 
and this will be a sign for you, and you will find a babe wrapped in swaddling clothes and lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of heavenly hosts praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace among men with whom he is pleased. Isn't that just beautiful? Oh my gosh, it's just absolutely beautiful. I just, I don't know. I don't have a lot to say because I think that that says it all. <laughs> so I'm just going to write on here Luke so that I know that this came from the book of Luke. And now I'm going to get these onto the page as well. Not in any real particular order. I just want to get these on and I will read them to you. Um, all right, so this is, whoops. Ooh, sticky, sticky. John 16, 24. Hitherto you have asked nothing in my name. Ask and you will receive that your joy, that your joy may be full. So, you know, all you have to do is ask, right? All you have, and believe. You have to ask and believe. You have to have faith, right? And remember... When you pray and God answers, it's in his timing, not ours, <laughs> right? Which is, of course, something that is not always easy, but he hears us. All right, so this is Philippians 4, 4. Rejoice in the Lord always. Again, I will say, rejoice. So rejoice is another word for joy, right? Rejoice, rejoice, rejoice. It's joy. You're rejoicing, right? You're in joy, right? So rejoice in the Lord always. Again, I will say rejoice. So I'll put that one, I think, right about there. And this is from um, a Bible that is in the version of revised standard version so that's why it had the word hitherto in there um i don't normally read from i i usually read from the new living translation the nlt version uh, but these did not come from from that version all right and then the last one is first thessalonians chapter 5 verse 16 Rejoice always, pray constantly, give thanks in all circumstances, for this is the will of God in Christ Jesus for you. So his will for us is for us to rejoice and be joyful. There you go. Again, you don't have to tell me twice. <laughs> Um, all right, so this is awesome. I love the way that this is going. Um, you know, so I, again, I had taken some things out. Obviously, these are not going to fit on here. Um, I do have this little word, joy, which I think maybe I could, like, even, like, just put that there. I could put it up here. Well, up there is already super chunky, so I think I'll just put it down here. And then that's going to be it. So that this is it. Gosh, did I say this is for Tag Tuesday? I don't think I said that. Forgive me, forgive me, forgive me. Oh my gosh. I was so excited about doing this. I don't think I mentioned that this is for Tag Tuesday. Um, Sherry from Turquoise Dreaming is the um, host of this collaboration. It's an open collaboration. And, um, yeah, so anybody can participate. Just let her know, and she will include your YouTube channel or Instagram link in her description box. And you will include your hers in yours. So you will find a link to her YouTube channel in my description box. Um, you know, I could edge the corners, but I don't think I'm, or the uh, edges with ink, but I don't know, I don't know. You know what, let's go ahead and do it. Why not? 
why the heck not? And in this December daily, I've pretty much, I think, been using vintage photo throughout the whole thing. I think what I'll do, since I've kind of been doing this throughout as well, just with the ink that's on there, I'm just gonna kind of do this. And it tones down that paper and just gives that really nice, beautiful, old look. All right, so that is it. So thank you, Sherry, for this collaboration. And let's go ahead and we're gonna get this in there. And oh, okay, so I have a little bit lower that word joy than I had wanted, but that's okay, we're gonna leave it. And let's go ahead and add this in here. So this is going to go right here. Put the other pages in. And there we go. There we go. So there it is in my December daily. Um, I could date it. I don't know that I need to. I don't have to, um, like for me personally, but maybe I will at some point, but not today. Um, and that's it. So that's my second prayer tag. Um, if you would like to see more videos like this, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And yeah, I will be back next week for another Tag Tuesday. All right, God bless everybody.